This is a tree. This is actually a cypress tree. Uh, they're really, they're really a big deal in Louisiana. And I planted this tree in quite a while ago. I actually planted three of them, and there's two that I still have. So, cypress tree. I'm gonna wait for this thing to get really big. It's gonna be awesome. 20 million trees. That's a lot of trees. It's a big number. If we planted 20 million trees, how much space would that take up? Is that like I don't know, Rhode Island space, or is that like Texas space? We're gonna have to do an order of estimation calculation to find out. How long would one person, if one person planted 20 million trees, how long would that take? What is 20 million? What, what's 20 million of anything? How long would it take to count 20 million? How many, how long would it take to make 20 million estimations? That's what we're gonna do. Okay, 20 million trees. How much area? Is it like Texas? Is it like Rhode Island? Maybe a state park? Maybe it'd fit in your backyard. It's not gonna fit in your backyard, we know that, okay. So let's just start with the basic estimation. So I'm gonna assume that a tree is like a circle, okay? Um, so if you're looking down from above, it takes up a circular area. I mean, yeah, trees aren't completely circular, but that's not a bad estimation. We gotta start somewhere. So if I looked in my backyard, I'm, I'm thinking of a pine tree in my head, a pine tree I have two pine trees that are about, they're about three meters apart. So I think you could probably get them that close together. I don't know if you would or not, but that's what's fun about an estimation, right? Okay, so let's say I have these two trees, like that, that's the center. And they're three meters apart. That means that the radius of one of these circles is 1.5 meters, okay? Um, so the first, well, I'm really only need the three meter thing. Uh, but if I pack these in a square packing like this, then each tree would actually take up a square that is three meters by three meters. So the area for one tree would be nine square meters. Okay, and that's just a rough estimate. It's not a big deal. Just an estimate. So now I just need to multiply that by 20 million trees. So area total is going to, and let's say n is 20 times 10 to the sixth trees. So the area total is going to be n times a1. So it's going to be 9 times 20. That's a bad 20. Look at that. Bad 20. 20 times 10 to the sixth square meters, this is, that actually goes right there. I'm gonna erase that. I'm gonna write it the right way. Nine meters squared times 20 times 10 to the sixth. Now look, you don't need a calculator for this. You really don't, because, you will in a second. Because nine times 20 is 180 times 10 to the sixth square meters. And that's the answer. Now, uh, let me go ahead and say that I don't know that you should plant trees this way. And in fact, if you really want to get them closer together, you could actually, there's another uh, packing formula that says take these, something like this, so they're kind of shifted. So you can pack things in closer, but I suspect that if you pack them this way, these trees will just take up all the available space anyway, so I would just do it this way, it's easier. Okay. So, um, 180 times 10 to the sixth square meters, that's kind of hard to, to determine what that value is. Uh, so really, let's get this in, and I know this is not the best way, okay? But we could get this in square miles. So I could say um, the area total is equal to 1.8 times 10 to the eighth meters squared, and to convert that to miles, all I need is the value of one square mile per meter squared. And you can look that up. Oh, and in fact, I did. It's 3.86 times 10 to the negative seventh. 3.86 times 10 to the negative seventh miles squared per one meter squared. This number, this fraction is one. So I can multiply my, my value by one. I don't really change it, okay? but these units of meter squared do indeed cancel. And so when I do that, I get 
a total area in miles for Americans, right? Square miles. Uh, then I printed out over here on my, I wrote it up in Python too, see. Uh, I get in square miles, 69 point, about 69.5 square miles, um, which is way smaller than I would think. That's just a, if you make a square, uh, we have 8.3 miles by 8.3 miles. That's not very big. Okay, so we're not talking state size. We're not talking Rhode Island. We're not talking Texas. We're talking state park size, right? And that doesn't seem right. Could you really get 20 million trees in there? Well, I mean, I actually Googled it. It's uh, the, the average is about 450 trees per acre. And so if you convert that to uh, trees per square mile, you do get about that same value. And see, I got, uh, did I do it right there? No. So that's how you would calculate the area for 20 million trees. Teamtrees.org, go. So that's 20 million trees by 2020 at teamtrees.org. One dollar, one tree. We can do it.